Hey guys, welcome to the new video of Team Hunk. Have you ever visited Etsy? Isn't that a wonderful store? Now you also can own a store like this. Yes, you heard right. Let's see how. Open your WordPress dashboard. Go to Appearance. Click on Add New Theme. Search for Shop Mania. Install and activate the theme. It is activated now. You can see the options for the theme. Click on Shop Mania options and then Starter Templates. Click on the Starter Site plugin and Import Demo. Here all templates are shown. You can filter the template by Page Builder and Template Category. We have to build an SE like store, and here is the template, but the template is premium. That means we need to upgrade the theme to Pro to import this demo. Click on the Upgrade to Pro button. You can buy the Shop Mania Pro from this page. Now log into the Members Area dashboard. Download the Shop Mania Pro. Now come back to your dashboard and upload the Shop Mania Pro plugin. After uploading it, you will see it appear here. Now go to Appearance and click on License. We need to enter the license key here, let's find out the key. You can get the license key from here. After pasting the key, click on Activate. Our theme is upgraded to Pro and the premium templates are unlocked now. This is the preview of the site. Once you are OK, click on Continue. Click on Build My Website. The website is ready. You get two options here. Customize and view the site. When I click on the Customize button, the page is opened with Elementor for customization. You can make your desired changes. When you click on something, its customization options open, where you can make significant changes. One of its most significant advantages is its drag and drop functionality, which makes it easy to create and customize websites without requiring extensive coding knowledge. Now save the changes and return back to this page. Now click on View Website. You can customize the basic website settings from this Customize button. From the Site Identity options, you can edit the site logo, title, and favicon. Here you find the pre-made layouts designed to change the appearance with different designs. You can choose whichever layout you like most. The typography gives you various options to customize the font sizes, line spacing, and other typographic elements that enhance readability and information hierarchy. Colors cannot be ignored when designing any type of website. Here you can target each part of the site to color. They help in creating attractive and visually appealing sites. You can also integrate your social handle here so that your users can also connect to you on other platforms like Instagram, X, and more. You also get customization options for preloader, menus, and homepage settings. The WooCommerce is one of the most important things on the site. You can personalize the pages and styles related to WooCommerce from this section. As you can check different layouts for the shop page and see them live. So finalize the layouts and move further. The additional CSS is used when you need to design beyond the basic styling of elements like font, color, and layout. Finally, don't forget to save changes. This is our home page. This is designed with multiple sections and competent designs to make users explore more about site. Let's head to the shop page. 
On the shop page, all products on your website are shown that you can sort by different means. The most popular, as the name signifies, is a special category page. Only popular products will be shown here. The About Us page shows about the company and its teams. You can also demonstrate the testimonial here. On the contact page, a form is given where users can fill in the details and write their message to the support team. Here a map is also given where you can enter your store's address. If you write blogs, you can show them here. By the way, blogs greatly help in marketing. The store manager page shows the dashboard for the vendors who sell on your site. They can get the analytics and reports through this page. Let's discover the homepage some more. These are categories. You can jump to a specific category by them. These are featured products. You can have a quick view from here. You can go to a single product page directly from here. From this icon, the product can be put into the wishlist so that you can check it later. You can compare two or more products from this icon. Click on Compare. You can see the detailed comparison of the products in the table. You can customize the table and order of titles from the plugin settings. Furthermore, you can add some more products with this button. Search for the product in the search bar. Click on it to add. You can also remove the products. This is a section, you can link it to any specific page. Here, bestseller products and blogs are shown. You can insert a frequently asked questions where several issues can be considered. If you want to buy something or visit the single product page, hover on the image or select options. You can see the details of the product from these sections. Set the quantity and click on Add to Cart. The products are added to the cart. Click on View Cart now. This is the cart page. For the checkout page, click on Proceed to Checkout. On this page, users have to fill in all the information that is asked and then it can proceed further. After filling in all the details, click on Place Order. The order is confirmed and these are the details. So this is how to create an Etsy-like website using WordPress and Elementor. You can download the theme using the link in the description. Thanks for watching.